What is going on guys, Tudwafa here, and welcome back to some more Ark Aberration. Now, last time we left off, we did a lot of research, we figured out how do we get a Reaper King tamed, and apparently we need to actually get casually impregnated. I know, it's crazy. Who would impregnate Danny DeVito? I don't know, but we're going to find out later, I guess, right? Jeez. But we found out that we need to get impregnated by like a, like a Reaper Queen, we need to like, you know, let her do what she needs to do and then kind of give birth in a small space preferably an area like that when you'd have the pheromones the uh reaper queen pheromones or whatever it's called the pheromone gland and to do that we need to actually kill a reaper queen so we need to actually you know kill one first so then uh, after that i guess we're going to have to almost kill one and then hopefully get impregnated by one that's going to be kind of crazy i know but i also wanted to do something we tried to do like two or three episodes ago and that is try and tame a basilisk now we've seen few basilisks down into the radiation zone. I do want to grab my eggs over here, lower level eggs. We have three fertilized right drink eggs. I did do a little bit more reading and research on it, and uh, we were really close to being able to tame one last time, but I had one fundamental flaw down, and that is that uh, the basilisks don't chase rock drakes like they don't get aggroed on rock drakes apparently and that's why it just kept on like forgetting about me like five seconds after i kept uh oh what in the world tap jeez there you go <laughs> that's why i just kept on forgetting about me like five seconds after we started attacking it and everything like that so i guess what i need to do is have it aggroed on me i need to dismount oh man some weird lighting glitch going on right now but i need to dismount off of my uh i guess i can probably go back here and fix the lighting glitch maybe go back and forth between where it changes but I could dismount and try and get it like aggro on me, probably use one of my guns, maybe my crossbow or something, try and get its attention. There we go, let's go back, let's see if it fixes the uh, lighting glitch, and then try and make it like lure it into the egg or something like that. Okay, whatever. Okay, well I guess it's just gonna look like trash, even though the game already looks like trash, right? Jeez. <laughs> Cause I have to play on lower settings. Anyways, I guess we could just kind of swoop down, see if we could find a basilisk down here, and preferably one that's not already burrowed, because apparently we do need them to be unburrowed in order for us to actually tame them, so... I'm just kind of looking in the distance, seeing if I can see any basilisks or their little tentacles, little tendrils, or whatever those are, and see if we'll be able to tame one of those bad boys, but... I don't know what le- oh, whoa! There's one of these Vespine gas geysers over here. Ooh, gas veins. Yeah, I should probably put my eggs inside of a the rock tray just because it weighs a lot, jeez. But I guess, uh, I'm, wait, hold on, which- Oh, yeah, okay, man, I was wondering, like, which rock tray am I on? Sheesh. <laughs> I guess because of the weird lighting, this one looks like one of my lower level, level 60 or something, or right rigs, but I'm not seeing a basilisk right now, which is actually kind of a good thing, because I don't want them being over here, because I do come over here every now and then, and kill a bunch of Karakinos, but, uh, I guess that kind of explains why we're not really seeing any, like, Karakinos right now, but, I'm not really seeing any basilisks right now, I might want to pause the recording, uh, that's, oh, that's a titanium bow, yep, that's a tiny basilisk, <laughs> I might want to pause the recording and try and find a basilisk real quick. I don't know what level we're aiming for. I, I forget what level the other one was, like level 60 something or something like that. I don't know. But I guess we could just kind of, uh, even if it's a low level one, we could try and tame it, I suppose. That one over there? Nah, it's just a snail fellow. We have a couple Karkinos over here we can kill, though. 558 damage, man! Yeah, I've been I've been upgrading my uh, Rock Drake a few times here and there. 86 board getting home right there. 403 Hectum Chitin. Man! We have so much Chitin already. It's crazy, I know. But, like I said, I did upgrade my Rock Drake's uh, stuff a little bit off camera. As you can see, stamina is over at 1,000. Health is 11,000. Uh, Mainly damage is 477. I think that was like 350% last time, so it's up a lot, you know. But, uh, right now, not really seeing any basilisk fellows. Oh, another rock. That's actually a really good thing right there. Rock drake egg. Mm, oh, there's a rock drake right there. Oh, a couple rock drakes. Ooh. Oh, yeah, and I did upgrade my shotgun as well. Just in case we do come across a Reaver Queen, hopefully I'll be able to get a lot of good shots with my shotgun, because apparently my shotgun is, like, insanely powerful. Is able to murder things very, very easily, as you guys saw by me. Literally just, like, pretty much one-shotting. Oh, my God, that's a really cool red-looking rock drake right there. We've got a blue one right there. I assume those are the parents of the egg back there. So, hopefully, once we get these guys nice and bad, there you go, one's down. Hopefully, we'll be able to go grab that egg without anyone caring. Let's go. Oh, Titanobo right there. Oh, kill it. There you go. Whoa, what was that, level 12? What level is that egg? That egg is level 12. All right, perfect. That's another egg we could use for the basilisk. Perfect. Because, of course, the low-level eggs, I don't really heck can care about. <laughs> I've been uh, mainly saving the low-level eggs for the basilisks anyways. Because, of course, it doesn't really matter what level the egg is whenever you feed a basilisk a fertilized egg. So, might as well use the lower-level ones, right? But I'm not seeing any around here. Even though the lighting glitch makes it a lot easier for me to see them, 
I'm just not seeing any right now, so I think I'm going to pause the recording for real this time. Look at that, two gigantic heckin' dung beetles right there. Prime dung beetles. Gotta pause the recording, try and find some basilisks, and I'll see you guys here in a bit. God. <laughs> All right, you guys are back, and I found the basilisk. I think it's level 90-something. I just zoomed in on it with my super spy glass. I'm kind of hurt up on this cliff. Let's see what level it is. Now, level 92, male, 9,900 health. Really good amount of health right there. Not bad at all. I did also get another egg. I did also get a, uh, it was a high-level rock drake egg, and I made two separate folders over here. As you can see, one of them is named Heckin' Eggs, and this is going to be for the higher-level ones. That way I know which ones to use and which ones to actually, you know, keep and maybe even hatch here in the future. And then over here we have trash eggs, which is the eggs that, you know, I'm, I'm not really too concerned about, you know, losing or using to tame a basilisk or anything like that. There are, there are low level eggs that who really cares about a level 12 rock drake, right? <laughs> Anyways, I did mention my uh, pump action shoddy. I did upgrade it. It is uh, legendary level now. I also maxed it out at 600% weapon damage. So now we're going to be able to murder things super duper easily if I ever come into melee uh, battle with anything. More specifically, like a Reaper Queen or anything like that. Hopefully, I'll be able to absolutely slaughter her. Seems like, oh, there's a carno over here. I do want to kind of clean out this area real quick. I am wearing my armor right now, my radiation armor. So it's not really the best. Uh, I wish I could wear my chitin armor right now, but I'm wearing my radiation armor because uh, we are in the radiation zone. But unfortunately, this isn't really my highest rated armor. I only have 2200 armor. Only 2200 armor. So let me grab that egg. And I guess what I could do is place the egg down in a path between me and the basilisk. Probably like maybe like right here or something like that. Oh, sheesh. There it is. Oh, there's the egg. Oh, is it coming? Oh, she's shooting stuff at me. Or it, or he, or whatever. Oh, God, he doesn't care. Oh, no, man, I just took insane damage right there. Mount on. Oh, my God, get on the rock, Drake. What in the world? Man, we're taking damage, and we're taking damage. We're taking poison as well. We need to watch the heck out. Come on, he's aggro on me. He doesn't care about the egg. Oh, I might need to get off my ro Oh, whoa, avoid that, man. <laughs> oh, my God, maybe the small space was a bad idea, you guys. Does he care? Is he going to eat that egg? Oh my god, what in the- What in the world happened? Okay, well we just tamed a basilisk. S oh my god, that's the pro- Oh my god. You know what, I'm naming it that, I don't even care. <laughs> that was a complete accident, by the way, you guys. I am so- Oh, Barry, ooh. Let's see, oh, I need a saddle for him. But what even happened right there? It looked like he was just standing there, and then suddenly he's chained to me with only one egg. <laughs> Anyways, where do I go here? Options. Where do I go? I don't know. Export Dino. I did see you guys saying, hey, you could use that to export to uh, other worlds and stuff, so I guess I don't have to go to Supply Drops to do that anymore, so that's kind of cool. Well, anyways, let me name this guy. S maybe mix a few capital ones in there, like that. Yeah, just kind of, yeah, there you go. That's what I'm talking about. He does. There we go. Anyways, I'll have a saddle for the base. Let's get see. What level do we need for the B is it this one? B is it B B B A S I? Uh I guess I have to see his actual name. What in the world? It's not even telling me what this thing is. Uh okay. Well I don't know. Oh wait, does it say down there? No, it doesn't even say what it is. It just says it's a s and that's it. <laughs> Oh my god, okay. Well, I assume it's basilisk, like Bazillosaurus and basil, like the plant. So that means I guess I need to be level 85 to make a saddle for him, and I guess that is a higher level primal or tech or alpha saddle or whatever that is, I assume. Alpha, because there is an alpha basilisk as well. But this guy just got tamed. What are his stats? It was like 9,900 last time, before he was tamed. Now it's a level- wait, that's my rock drake, whoops. Let's see. Oh, so his, his stats got nerfed after he got tamed. Whoopsie daisy. But he did get tamed at baseline 137 after a taming bonus. That's really good. I assume that was 99% taming bonus, and therefore he got about half of his levels as a part of a bonus. Anyways, one level 137. He's got a really good carry weight at 28 right there. Melee damage is not that bad at half of that at 14. Health is kind of uh, eh, at 16, and uh, stamina is at 17. Eh. I'm like, I can't really complain about the carry weight. How, what, what is the carry weight? How many pounds? Three! Th oh my god! If this guy can slither up, like, walls and stuff, which maybe he can, I don't know, this guy's gotta be crazy good for getting materials, preferably, um, like, metal and crystals and stuff like that, because oh, nameless! Because right now, I'm using my rock drakes, just kind of flying them up, or flying them down, and then uh, using them to climb up the walls. Oh, uh, turn the light on. 
I don't know why my light's not being turned on, but climbing up the walls and stuff. But of course, these guys only have a couple hundred pounds of uh, carry weight. Of course, this one is better. At 806, of course, I've been upgrading that as well. But with 3,000 carry weight right there, man, I can't complain about that one bit. So what level was that? Uh, what level are we? We're 84. Uh, Basilisk was 85, wasn't it? Ooh, that's really good. Uh, we're about halfway to another level up right now. Honestly, I kind of want to go back home. I guess one uh, one end of that is because, you know, of course we have a base list. I don't really want to, like, leave them here or anything like that. I, yeah, let, let's see. We're in a pretty deep area right now. Oh, hold on. Wait, where, where did he go? Man, I'm getting chased by a bunch of stuff over here. Or did he just fall off or something? Where'd he go? He's gone. Is he down here? Up oh, there. Yep, he's down there. Um, I guess he can't climb up or else he would have climbed up here by now. It seems like he's trying to climb up, but not being very successful. Man! Well, if anything... Oh! Yeah, I don't know. He's just kind of slithering all over the place, guys. <laughs> Man, I'm going to have to find a way for this guy to get out of here. Because uh, it took me like a million years to try and find my way out of here with my uh, my Spino and all them. But unfortunately... I don't know where in the world I am and where I need to go. <laughs> uh, I don't think I can pick these guys up with my Roderick or anything, honestly. Because these guys aren't technically flyers. There you go. He just kind of slithered through that. I might have to spend a lot of time here trying to figure out where I am first of all <laughs> and then uh, figure out where we need to go and there is a waterfall right here that goes down, Element Waterfall, whatever you want to call it Element Falls that is the name of the area or something like that uh, there's something green all the way over there I wonder if that's where we need to go but man, I need to find where in the world we need to go and then once we find- oh god he just- oh that's it, he's dead isn't he? that's it, my- what in the world- oh! I just got a- I just got an explorer note! Oh, I know where I'm at! Wait, what in the world? Oh yeah, I know where I'm at! I remember this explorer note, I- I remember... Like, specifically not getting that explorer note. I know where- a rough idea where I am now. But I don't know where to go from here, I think. <laughs> oh wait! I don't remember it being like right next to an element river. Yeah, I don't know where I'm at then. <laughs> ah, there are feather lights and stuff around here though. I guess if anything, we could try and find, uh, fight some critters, take advantage of this, uh, double XP we got going on, especially for me. Because I do need to level up, you know. I do need to level- Oh, what is that? Is that like an Alpha Carno up there? It seems like an Alpha Carno. Whoa, that thing looks big! That's a big ol' Alpha Carno. Wait, uh, get over here, fight it, fight it, murder it, spit at it. Oh, we're taking damage over here. Still about ten whole minutes of a double XP for us. Hopefully, uh, whoever gets the- Oh, Secret just got killed. Whoever gets the thing killed, I wonder if my, uh, Little Basilisk has double XP as well, then whoever's gonna kill him is gonna get insane amounts of... Oh man. Is he bloody? I can't tell because he's already red around them. <laughs> ah, at least we're holding up over here. We got a really good armor rating on our right rank. Of course my Basilisk has like 5,000 health himself, which is actually about what we have on our right rank too. Uh, actually our right rank has like double that, forgot about that, yeah. Man, it, yeah, yeah, he is getting bloody, yeah, look at that. Oh, and now Alpha Carno looks like the Rodri got the kill. Wow. And we leveled up right. What in the world? What? What? 27 level ups? Where did that come from? I got a level up. Level. Uh, I guess I'm going to have 300 health now. What in the world? 27 level ups. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. But <laughs> I don't know what to do. More health. Man, let's get to 15,000 health. Melee damage, let's get that up to 600%. So I have even more level ups, you guys. You could get more, uh, stamina. Stamina's always one that's always kind of trailing behind. Might as well get that up to, like, 1,500. I guess that double XP plus the avocado and all that. Man, and you guys saw I was, like, halfway to level 85, which now I guess we could unlock the, um, Engram for the, or, uh, what's it called? Not Basilosaurus, but Basilisk. <laughs> The Basilisk Saddle. Now we can get that. Another Ron Drake right there. Another Ron Drake egg. Kill that Spino. But now we can unlock that. You guys saw I got half of a level of XP from that thing. Thanks to double XP. I assume if I kill that thing without the double XP, I only got a quarter level uh, level up from that. Which is crazy already. But man, wait. No. I think I got a full level up from that. Because I'm already halfway to level 86. Look at that! Well, almost halfway. Jeez! Man! It's insane my Rock Tree has even more level ups over here, you guys. Man! I'm inadvertently going on a rampage over here getting insane about of level. Wait, what in the world? This is called a Wyvern Nest. Whatever. Anyways, let's try and grab the egg. Oh, level 8. Yep, that's going right in the trash eggs thing. But I guess that's good to. Oh, what's. 
Is that Perlovia? That is Perlovia. Man, that weird looking badger critter. But I guess that's a good thing. That is a low level egg. And, the, oh my god, is that no, another alpha? No way. How many alpha cardos are we going to come in contact with, guys? Man, where's my basilisk? Come over here, kill him, murder him. I might want to get him with my shotgun and try and get myself. Then again, we got like 27 levels from that thing with double XP. I might want to get a couple shots on him just to kind of wear him down a little bit. Make him, oh, never mind. I just killed him myself. Mm, I just got myself a level up. <laughs> oh my god, this double XP is insane. I got two level. Wait, hold on. I got one level up. Okay, okay. Whew. I was trying to get some more carry weight right there. Man! Oh, it went a little bit more to 86 or 87 right there. I see another wyvern egg up there, you guys. I might want to... Well, is that another... That is another double XP right there. Looks like a little backpack. Anyways. It sounded like someone just whistled like a tribes person. I don't know what that noise was. Anyways, there is definitely a supply drop right... Is that it? Right there. Yeah, that little backpack, that is so obvious. Or, uh, not a supply drop, but a double XP. That's what it is. Let me get on this wyvern nest and pick that level 6 egg. That is nothing. Man! Where is he? Oh, there they are. There are the wyverns. Or, er, the Rodrake. The I-can't-even-fly-yet wyverns. The chicken versions of wyverns, because they can't heck and fly. <laughs> uh, but then again, can chickens glide? I don't think so. Uh, who knows? Maybe chickens can glide, but no one's ever caught on camera. I don't know. I'm just kind of talking out my butthole right now. <laughs> oh, I need to put these wyvern, or, uh, these Roderick uh, eggs up in the trash eggs folder. It's kind of savage, I know. <laughs> there you go, double XP. We still have about five or so more minutes left right now. Five minutes, 13 seconds of double XP right now. We are, whoa! Okay, you guys, I might want to put these, <laughs> on one hand, I kind of want to put the, uh, Roderick eggs in my, uh, Basilis inventory, but at the same time, I don't want him eating them, because he does have a lot of carry weight, you know, so it might be really good to Kind of keep them in his inventory and stuff like that, but then again, we're kind of picking up eggs like all over the heckin' place like it's nothing. We are gaining elevation up here. I did see there was like a mound right there. I knew a Perlovia was going to come out of there, but he didn't actually like come out for some reason. <laughs> There's another one right there. I don't think he's going to come. Oh, is that another Alpha Carno? My gosh! See, I'm trying to say gosh a little bit more. See? Jeez. <laughs> Anyways. Oh. Roderick. Oh, that Roderick doesn't care. Okay, that's good. Whew. We still have double XP for a little bit, but I do. Oh, whoa, whoa, nameless. What is it? Oh my god! Glowbug. Oh man, killer glowbug on the loose, you guys. Oh, it's a Rotrake. Man, I didn't even know that thing was attacking us. I thought it was my own Rotrake. Sheesh. Well, anyways, let's try to get some level ups here in a minute. But I do need to get rid of some of the carry weight off of uh, these eggs, Ada. These nuts. <laughs> these eggs. <laughs> there we go. God, 15 year old expired memes. I should just bring back, like, memes from the 90s and start using those. Refreshing those memes. <laughs> Resurrecting memes. I'm a meme necromancer. I said that back in Skyrim. There's another Alpha Carno. Man! Is it now? Yeah, that's gotta be now. Look at how big that thing is. Man, I don't want to get it with my shotgun because I know how much how much damage did I do to that other Carno with my uh with my shotgun? I didn't even pay attention. Whoa, I probably should have paid attention to be quite honest. Sheesh, this one's already getting bloody! Whoa! My rock tree got the killing blow! Six okay, only six levels right there. What in the world? I don't know how we had so many level ups before. I think a lot of those level ups, yeah. I forget, but whenever you discover an explorer note, you get a lot of level ups just by discovering it. Yeah, I forgot about that, but to get like 20 of those? I don't know, that just doesn't sound right, I don't know. Maybe I had a, level, uh, a lot of level ups already and just, just never applied them and they just kept stacking and stacking and stacking, I don't know. Anyways, I have no idea, speaking of not knowing things, I don't know where I am still. <laughs> I don't know where to go, I don't know where... I if I even went in a circle or something, I don't know. It seems like I might have. I don't know. That's just a regular carno right there. We got a rock drake back there. Um, I don't even know what's ahead. I can't tell. There's a seeker, of course. There's a rock drake up there. I don't even know where I'm at right now, you guys. But, <laughs> oh, I might need to pause the recording just kind of. Oh, thankfully, thankfully. My, oh, Mayless Horses. Thankfully, my uh, Bazil's Horse, or <laughs> Basilisk. Thankfully, he's still by my side and didn't get completely lost or fall into the Element Falls River or anything like that, which is good. Knock on wood. I don't have any wood nearby, but you get the idea, right? Oh, oh, speaking of such, speaking of the devil, he's killing someone. Did he get him? No, he didn't kill that Arthur Blur. Just kill him. What are you doing? Murder him. There he goes. 704 damage. Man! I don't know if you guys showed, or if I showed it you guys, but, uh, oh yeah, I did it on camera. He has seven levels now. God! Okay, well, uh, melee damage. Let's go up to 682% melee damage. Wow! I want to get his health up to like 20,000. I don't know, maybe. Anyways, let's just go this way. Just because I don't even know where to go. I might as well just go wherever I feel like, right? <laughs> uh, where does this go? 
I don't know. Looks like an element river or something like that. This guy's kind of stuck in a tree. Yep, you're dying, Hayden. I just freed you from the tree, and now I'm going to free you from life itself. He has been freed from the anchors, the chains, the jail of a living. Okay, I don't know where I was going with that. I don't even know what I just said. But I need to go somewhere. Is that... Oh, yep, that's death. Yeah, let's not go that way. Can you, like, back up and not, like, take a million... Raid. Oh, she, she, oh, oh, no, no, my God, he's dead. He is dead. No, 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 my God, he's taking damage. 200, 200. No, man, man. Oh, my God. See, that's what I'm talking about. He's, he's going to die any second now. He's got 5,000 health. It's going to take a little while. He's fighting something down there. Nine, 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 nine. What is he fighting? I don't know. He's almost heckin' dead. That's why I didn't leave anything in his inventory. Oh, man, this is what I'm talking about, you guys. I, I didn't have any wood to knock on, and there we go. He heckin' fell into the element. He's dead, isn't he? Where is he? I guess not anything. I, man, I really need to find a basil. Oh, is that him? That's a dead body down there. Ah, oh, man. Come on. I'm wasting this double XP. I'm more concerned about my double XP than I am about that basil. Oh, he got out. He got out. No, no, get out. Get out of the heckin' element, you dumb. No. No, he's almost dead. No! Oh man, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh, there you go. Man, you're almost dead. You're taking 200 damage per second, you big old dumb. Man, get out of there. <gasps> no, not yet. He's dead. Well, let's go harvest the dead flesh. Might as well get a little bit of something from him. Sheesh. Gah. <laughs> oh, he dies, and not even a second goes by. And I'm like, yeah, okay, well, let's just go harvest his dead flesh. And can you say, oh my god, Nidaria. What in the world? There are Nidaria in the element? I didn't even notice that. What? Can I kill these guys? Oh my god, I can. And I got some biotoxin from them. What in the world? There's like a thousand of them. There's one right there. There's one there. There, there, there. Oh my god. Can I tame a Nidarian and ride a heckin' Nidarian here? Because I did get counsel from you guys saying, oh, no, no, no. No, he's going to move. He's going to move. No, 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 no. I want to harvest the dead flesh, not you. I shall harvest the dead flesh. Oh my god, look at his mouth. Ugh. Uh, he's screaming for his life, but he's already hecking dead. Oh my god, oh yeah, y'all had all the eggs in his inventory, yeah, I forgot about that, whoops, prime hide or something like that. Oh yeah, speaking of food, I did change uh, my primary diet to cooked prime meat, I did get a lot of comments from you guys saying, hey, why don't you use uh, cooked prime meat, Hater? and I, that's what I'm starting to do, because I have a lot of prime meat anyways, might as well start using it. Anyways, that's the death of that fellow, whoops, I really need to find one that's like, oh man, I can't move, yeah, I really need to find one that's like not, like heckin', uh, there you go, can I move now? I still can't move. That's not, uh, like, in the middle of Element Falls and stuff where I can, like, not even nag me <laughs> navigate myself out. <laughs> I really need to find one, like, in the Bioluminescent Zone or back in the Mushroom Kingdom area, you know? I really need to find one over there. Well, thankfully, we have a lot of Roderick eggs we could use, you know, but, uh, can I... There we go. Whew. And thankfully, we're on a rock trick in the first place because, uh, egg. Oh, look at that. Uh, that's a level 136. Okay. Let's put these... Oh, I can't put these eggs in here? Wait, does this work? Remember that? Did that work? Are the eggs still at the bottom? Oh, it worked! Whoa! Okay, well, while we're here... Oh, can I not move? Oh, man, I can't move anymore. Too heavy to climb. Ah, uh, guess I'll use a level up for that. Anyways, uh, raw meat. Yeah, I get rid of all that. I don't care. Oh, my God! I had, like, 300 pounds of raw meat on me. What? Let's try and kill that night area. Get a little bit of biotoxin from him. 16 more, guys! I can make it myself- Oh! Am I taking da- No, I'm not taking damage. Okay, that's good. Whew. I don't even know what's going on with this episode, you guys. We're- Taylor the Basilisk, we're just kind of memeing around over here. Got double XP for a little while. Leveled up, like, a billion level ups by, like, one Alpha Carno murder. Then we found, like, 2,000 other Alpha Carnos. It's crazy, I know. Oh, don't fall in the element! Oh! Whoa! We got it! We got it! To the other side! Safe and sound. Can't say the same thing about my Basilisk, right? Rest in peace. Sheesh. I'm an absolute savage. I don't even care. <laughs> oh, man. Wait, is this where we tamed him in the first place? I think it is. It just feels familiar. Well, that's the circle of life, I guess, right? Sheesh, literally, because he went in a circle and he's dead now. Sheesh. Anyways, I don't know what's going on right now. I might pause the recording and try and find my way out of here and maybe tame another basilisk in the bioluminescent zone or the mushroom kingdom or whatever you want to call it that I mentioned earlier. It seems like it's a better idea to do that there. Another supplier, another uh, double XP right there. Oh! What? What? Never mind. Reaper Queen! What? Is that a queen? Yep, it is! 45,000 health. 45,000 health, you guys. We need to- Oh my god, I'm getting- What in the world? I think those are like little spines that she's thrown at us, like little spears. We need to 
Oh! Getting damaged by him a little bit. They only do, they only do like one damage per hit, though. So we don't need to worry that much about him. But we are taking damage over here. Slowly but surely, we need to try and wear her down with my shotgun killer. Get the fungo. What am I saying? Fungal? Uh, I forget what it's called, but the, some sort of gland. I forget what it's called. But she just kind of unburrowed out of there. Oh, there she is right there. Man, it's been a long time since we've seen one, like 15, 20 episodes or something like that. And remember, we did kill one last time we came in contact with one. But of course, that wasn't an alternate universe, so that basically didn't even happen, right? Anyways, you need to watch that go. Another, uh, another secret right there. 217 damage per thing. Not bad. Really, really good. I assume we'll be able to do over a thousand damage per thing here in just a moment. Still, man, I need to turn my guy's light out. Hold on, what in the world? Why is that not working? Why do I have to rebind it every time? What in the world? Turn that off. There you go. Now the secret shouldn't be attracted to me anymore. I know, I'm just too attractive. Even though I haven't done a face reveal. It's kind of crazy, I know. I did a neck reveal, though. Alright, there's... The, oh, oh. Yep, there she is right there. Get her with a shotgun. Get her with a shotgun. 20. Oh my god, we're only doing 9 plus 10 damage per hit. What? Oh my god. Get out, get out, get out. No, oh, man. Man. I wonder how she must have insane armor rating or something. Man. Oh. Oh, I guess we regen all that health already. What? Okay, well, I'm not complaining. <laughs> Anyways, I kind of want to melee her with my Roderick just to see how much damage we do. And of course we can just kind of escape out of here. We need to fall. Oh my god, there's a lot of, uh... Vespine gas guys over here, you guys. This is a really good place to... Where is she? I don't know, but she's here. She's somewhere. I wonder if we can lure her into the, uh, into the element. Kill her. Find her dead body and get the gland out of that. There's the element right there. I, I, I can just assume that she's impervious to that. That she will not take any damage from it. But then again... Oh, is that her? Is that a Roderick? That is a Roderick. Can she cloak? I don't think so. Maybe she can, I just don't know about it. Is that another Alpha Carno? No, it's not. I don't think. Maybe it is. I don't know. <laughs> oh, we do have another dog. Oh, there she is back there. I just saw her gigantic heck and tail. 798 damage to these guys. Man, I'm not bragging, but oh, wait, she's literally hanging out in the element. She just dug into the element river. What? And now she's going to unburrow from the element river. No, no she's, just still, she's just still in the element right there, you guys. Well, there goes that plan. What in the world? How are we cold? And there's like a megalosaurus in the element river. What? You guys see that? Where'd it go? There's another, a uh, rock drag. There, wait, right there. There is a literally, or is that a carno? Whatever. There is a critter in the, look at that guy. He's hanging out in the element water. Is this even element? Any, I don't even know if it is element. Is it element? I don't know. Is that carno dead? I don't know. Let's see what's going on. Um, oh, nameless, man. When we turn the name, or when we turn the light on, we have billions of seekers. When we turn the light off, we have a billion nameless. I might as well just have one of these lights just kind of flicker on and off. That way we'll never get anything, or we'll get a lot of everything, because it'll just kind of cancel itself out. I don't know. <laughs> Is that Carter almost dead? He's full health, isn't he? Yeah, he's full health. What even is this stuff? I kind of want to go into the water just to see what happens. <laughs> oh, just kill these stupid nameless already. Man, that Reaper Queen is like right there. You guys see that? Just like a pile of rocks coming out of the water right there. I'm pretty sure that's her, right? I don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it's not. Well, there's the, uh... Carno. I don't know. Oh, that guy just burped. Ugh. Oh my god. What in the world? I'm taking damage. But the Carno isn't. The nameless aren't. What? Well, I guess if anything, it's not really that much damage, so I don't need to worry about it too much. But there are leech fellows, or miniature eels, or whatever those critters are. We need to watch out for that as well. Let's watch out for these things possibly erupting and murdering us instantly. Gah! How's my armor doing? How's my hazard suit armor doing? I'm pretty sure it's almost heckin' broken by now. There goes my phone. It's, it's doing pretty well, not bad. Man, we need to, like, formulate a strategy over here, guys. Just kind of memeing around. Look at the- Look at the heckin' queen! Look at that, we found a way to the queen! She's just hanging out in the element, like I said. She just dug a hole into the water. What? Try saying that out loud without getting arrested. Man! What's she doing? She just standing there doing nothing. Oh, a lot of spines. We're doing a whopping 39 damage to her, you guys. We lad. Okay, well, I don't know what's going on. Oh, more spines. We're doing way more damage with our shotgun. Oh, my God. Then again, we're not really taking that much from her, yeah. Pretty much just 100 damage total right there. <laughs> I'm not bragging, but... It's just a fact. Anyways, I wonder if we can actually shoot her like a million times from this vantage point. Oh, 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 never mind, she's down. She's out on the ground. Or she's back in the ground, I guess, right? Where is she? Where did she go? I don't know. She's gone. 
Come on, come on, wherever you are, hater. I also made more uh, shotgun shells, by the way. But, uh, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be using them because she's just kind of hanging out under- Oh! Oh, there she is. Oh, playing hide and seek with us, huh? That's pretty fun. There we go. 21, 21. There we go. Get all these 21s. Look at all that damage I'm doing, hater. Oh, I guess enough of these and eventually she's going to get heckin' killed, right? I don't know, maybe. But I need to see. I did get a lot of comments from you guys saying, hey, why don't you use a shield? I also read that on the thing, too. But, oh, there's an earthquake. But, eh, uh, riot shield? I don't know if I'm able to get that in this series just yet. I think it need to be level 90-something. Or maybe 80-something by now. Maybe I can unlock it. I don't know. I guess I'll have to check here in a bit. But uh, how are we going to kill her, though? That's what I want to know. And, of course, to, uh... Wow, we did, like, 4,000 damage right there. Not bad. I'm not bragging. Hmm. Now, of course, we could just get a huge dino pack like we did last time. And just kind of wear it down that way using a bunch of... Uh, well, we had one spino. But a bunch of uh, megalosauruses. That's what we did. Oh! I wonder, though. Hold on. What about the, uh... The Rock Drake Little Glide Swoop In ability? That does a lot of extra damage. I wonder if it does any damage to her. Come on. Oh my god, I can't even see anything. God, there she is all the way over there, the Reaper Queen. I keep calling her Rod Drakes and stuff. I don't know. Oh, man. Oh, there she is. I, I can't get, like, a good enough distance from her to actually use the ability, you know? Hey, Megalosaurus, how you doing? Now it's time for you to die. Rah, there you go. Got him. And got him. And 21. Where did you... Oh, god, she's gone. Man. Where'd she go? I got another level up, though. Come on, don't land on the double XP explorer note. There we go. Let's go over here. This seems like a really good spot. I just have to wait for her to come back out, but I guess right now she's just kind of in hiding because she's afraid. She knows I can kill her if I had a thousand more rounds of ammunition or something, right? Jeez. <laughs> Which I could probably do, honestly. I have, I have tons of uh, metal and all that kind of stuff back home, but hmm. We could, uh, melee damage, almost 700%, man! God, that is insane! Oh, we have some stim berries, might as well eat them, because I'm getting a little bit of torpidity. Hmm, there she is down there, you can see that right there. Bunch of rubble just in the air. Well, there you go, she's dead, or that seeker is. Is that another one there in the background? I don't think it is. I think it's just a thing erupting. Another, whatever you call it, a Vespine gas geyser. Even though that's not even not what you call it. <laughs> It is a gas geyser, though. Just not a being gas. Just making StarCraft memes over here. Alright, man, she's still over there. I really just want to swoop in on her or something. And then again, she's not even doing that much damage to us. I'm not bragging, but I'm just saying facts. Might be able to, uh, if I had enough patience, eh, I don't know, just get a lot of, uh, what do you call it? Carnivore baby food, feed my rock drake over and over. All that kind of stuff, and then, you know, of course, shoot her a million times with my, uh, shotgun. Maybe I'll create my shotgun even more. There is another tier above, uh, Legendary Primal, I believe. We'll be able to do 750% melee damage or something like that. Crazy, I know. I'm not bragging, it's just a fact. Hmm. A lot of things we could do ahead of us, you guys, to possibly murder this heckin- Oh, God! No, no, no! Oh, there she is! Let's go! Let's go! Get out of here! Oh, she's in the water again. Oh, oh, no, my God, swoop in on her. No, man, we're in the water. Oh, whoa, whoa, get out of here. Whoa, this way, man. Let's go this way. Come on, go. Where are you going? This way. There we go. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure here in the future we'll be able to find a million more of these Reaper Queens. But for right now, I really just want to find my way out of this heckin' place. <laughs> There's a supply drop up there, or a loot crate. I don't even think I've ever seen this place over here. With a bunch of, like, metal and stuff, I don't think I've seen that- OH! Now the Roger right down there. But I'm sure we'll come and cut with- Come and come, come, come- Oh my god, no! Oh god, that's it, I'm dead. Ugh. I hate when that happens, just runs off for no reason at all. Gotta get my gun out. Ready to murder. There we go. Ah, come on, what in the world are you doing? Anyways, let's try and get ourselves a little bit of loot from the loot crowd. Oh my god, a blueprint, not even an actual thing, but a blueprint for a water jar. Will lad. Where does she go? There she is right there. Ready for me to almost heck and die because she has to run off for whatever reason. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know where to go right now, you guys. I'm just kind of lost. I'm just kind of memeing around right now. I don't know if you guys figured that out, but I'm just kind of memeing. <laughs> and the world's over there. Oh, jeez, I thought I was going to fall into my death. Come on, we need to find our way out of here, you guys, and just find uh, another- I, I think I had like 20 minutes ago, I was like, hey, my heckin' basilisk is dead. I'm gonna pause the recording and try and find one in the bioluminescent zone or something like that, but then again, we did get encountered, we did get uh, confronted by a heckin' reaper queen, we found a way to the queen, 
but not necessarily the type of queen we wanted, right? She didn't want us. She didn't want any part of us. Rest in peace. Anyways, let's go this way. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Let's just get <laughs> let's just go this way. And, uh, I guess just kind of swoop upwards in general is always a good idea if you want to kind of escape this super duper deep area over here. Whoa, carnos and megalosaurus. And a spino over there for whatever reason. I don't know what that spino is doing. It's kind of a river critter, but there's no rivers to be found. Oh, swoop in on the spino. Yeah, look at that. Man, that thing just got knocked halfway across him. He's still flying. He's still flying. Hit him again. Hit him again. Hit him again. Hit him again. Yeah, no, I'm going to miss now, man. Hey, there's this. Oh, I thought he died. What? No, oh, he's dead now. <laughs> Oh, he's dead now, jeez. I don't know what I'm doing, you guys. I'm just kind of memeing, like I said. <laughs> so I'm going to pause the recording and try and find my way out of here. Probably find uh, another basilisk in the ba a bioluminescent zone or even in the mushroom area where our base is, you know? Because uh, we did see a basilisk over by the, uh, the what do we call it? The, the beehive. But that was an alpha basilisk. I don't know if we're able to tame those. Uh, if so, maybe it's the same method or something. I have no idea. Well, anyways, oh, we need stamina. And we have a low level we can do. What do we want to do? More mail? Yeah, there we go, 700%. Oh, man, I don't want to drop out this water jar blueprint. I need to keep that in my inventory. Whew. What else do we have around here? I legitimately don't know where I'm at. I've never seen any of this before. Uh, oh, I see mushrooms up there. I guess we're going up there, you guys. Oh, what is this, Mario? I'm over here obsessed about mushrooms. Oh, the lighting fixed itself earlier on, I guess, right? That's a good thing, right? <laughs> oh, we don't have that weird, like, oddly bright, bioluminescent area look going on anymore, I suppose. But it does seem like, oh my god, what is that? The Towers of, uh, whatever. The, that looks like the, the, the Sauron thing. What in the world? That looks like the George Soros thing. What? Oh, man! Oh, jeez, laid on it. Oh my god. Oh my god, come on. Whoo! We have, like, no stamina. I think we found our way out, you guys. And there's the surface up there. Oh my god, that's an actual waterfall. Not an element fall. Oh, man, we found our way out, you guys. I've been just over here just kind of memeing, just having fun, doing nothing. <laughs> oh, man, I, I guess if anything, we can go back home and uh, try and formulate that strategy. Where, uh, I don't know. I do need a lot of shotgun shells. Those aren't the most expensive thing in the universe. Maybe come back here, try and find another Reaper Queen, and then all that kind of stuff, do all that again, but be a little bit more prepared this time, because, of course, we keep doing 21, 21. Oh, no, that's it, we're dead. Oh, God, no. Man, the universe doesn't like that I'm doing the 21 meme, even though it's from, like, 2014. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, God, what's that noise? Oh, an invisible Rod Drake fellow. What in the world? Oh, what in the world? Whoa, no way. Whoa, my Rod Drake's level 232 right now. I know, I know. I'm going to get comments from you guys saying, Oh, this other YouTuber has a level 500 Rod Drake. <laughs> I know. Can't I have nice things for once without everyone saying it's trash? Ah. Ugh. Anyways, let's get out of here. I don't know what's going on anymore. I'm just kind of over here just memeing hard hardcore. We've, I've never done this before. I'm just over here just memeing. Usually I'd cut this trash out, but I'm just having fun just being a meme. <laughs> oh, let's go. Oh my, why can't I move? Wait. No way. No heckin' way. Right over here is the... No, yep. What in the world? Over there is our standing torch beacon. We found the surface, basically where our beacon was. Now that is crazy. Or is that the Illuminati? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, let's grab some of this stuff like hide and stuff. I do need that to make uh, re armor reagents, whether it be uh, armor, damage reagents, all that kind of stuff. That stuff is very, very expensive. I do need that in my inventory. A lot of hide, a lot of kite and all that kind of stuff, especially for my kite and armor. My kite and armor. Oh! Okay, cover your mouth. Who burps out loud like that? That is just rude. <laughs> 41 damage right there at 41, 41. Oh, nameless, 824 damage, not bad.